So I decided to do this two week challenge of collating. And it's been crazy, guys. <music> Hello everyone, how are you? I'm great and I usually post travel videos but today I'm going to share my experience doing Chloe Ting's most popular workout videos which are Chloe Ting's two week stretch challenge. So I decided to do this challenge because end of last year in 2020, I was really feeling unfit. I was on a trip in Bali and I have to hike a lot of yeah. sites and after those hikes, I am completely unfit. <laughs> So I decided I need to get fit. I asked my friend, what are you guys doing to get fit? And they recommend this challenge. When I look it up, it was all weeks, okay? I think I can commit for two weeks. And then the journey begins. Ding, ding, ding. OMG, yeah. The first day, I was literally out of breath. I feel like I wanna die, seriously. But then the second day, I was totally knocked out. I cannot do workout. I just do some cardio of like dancing, dancing. And then I can go on to the third day. But the third day is actually the second day because I took the day off, right? Yeah. Then I can cook do it and then, wow guys, it was really great. And now it's the third day and I'm like, Feeling so good. I did like four workouts today. It's supposed to be 40 minutes if you do it all in one go. But then of course I need to rest guys. So I took like two hours. I start from like 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. And I'm literally out of breath. But I feel so much better already. So so happy. And for all of you who are in your fitness journey and working out, please trust in yourself. It doesn't have to be in terms of numbers of weight that you lose, but the fact that you can do all of these exercises, that just makes me feel so happy, right? Like gain this so much strength. So yeah. Let's go and continue and finish this. You So today is the fifth day of the Chloe Ting two week stretch challenge but I'm outdoor because it's active rest day and it just happened to be the day that I'm going out and going track. Yes. I don't know where I'm going, it's such a beautiful place. Make sure you watch that video and I'll see you tomorrow on the sixth day. Let's go! Day 6 of the workout, I'm back from the hiking and surprisingly my feet is fine the day after. So I can continue to work out despite having to walk 12,000 steps during the hike. Is this because of the workout? I'm not sure but I'm definitely going to continue. After a few days, my progress was that I can finish the workout faster but it's still longer than the intended time. For instance, I have to do 30 minutes, I did it in 1 hour but Yay! Progress is still progress, right? Anyway, don't forget to do some warm-ups before and a cooling down after. Also, wear shoes, guys. In the beginning, I didn't. And although I didn't get any blister, but I think after I wear shoes, the workout felt lighter. So, wear shoes, definitely. I'm outside and it's day 9 of the co-eating challenge. Because yay, it's active rest day. So actually it's already like noon. And I just want to walk around to keep my body fit. As you can see, my postures weren't great, but I didn't care about how to do the movements. My goal was to just finish the workouts and get the pacing of the workout. And afterwards, I can focus on how I should do the movements. But after I record, it definitely gives me knowledge on which areas that I should improve and get better. Also tips from other YouTubers doing this workout, they say after doing this challenge and recording it, there is this sense of accountability that keeps the motivation going for doing the workout every single day. So. After doing it myself, yeah, I think there is this accountability and definitely if you are doing this, get a support system, tell your friends or some of your friends or maybe post it to your close friends so they know and you can get that motivation going. 
but most importantly listen to your body and what you need don't push yourself too much but definitely you have to keep going another realization that i had was this concept of inertia which is the tendency to remain unchanged so if we're already moving just keep moving there's always the low impact version that we can use or you can just stand still and walk around but just keep your body moving while catching those breaths the last day of my Chloe thing two extra challenge yay 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 I'm so happy when I realized it I was like oh yes I've been waiting for this day I never thought that this day will actually come I mean there were doubts baby because when I started I looked really tired but now we're on the last day so I'm so hyped you know there's this excitement on the first day and on the last day so Let's get to it guys, four more works out and then we're done, yay! the difference the first time I recorded this video like after a workout I was literally out of breath but now it was like the same workout four workouts and now like I don't I'm not out of breath like this is amazing and that's like one of the most important thing about this challenge it's not about the weight and everything but the fact that you're getting fitter and you can feel it that's amazing and now it's the moment of truth I'm gonna measure my weight I'm really Scared. Let's go. Woo! Guys, this is not. Wow. I lost three kilograms. What? Yeah. Okay. Yay. OMG. I'm literally so happy. Yay. Wow. Okay. Thank you so much, Chloe. And I'm definitely doing this workout more. I don't know. See. But I'm trying to get my better and fitter after I finished the two weeks and see the result I think I just got so motivated to do it again for another two weeks but I don't do it like in streak I take on week break where I just do fun workout like cardio and dancing Zumba or just trying some random YouTube videos and now we're done with another two weeks I think I feel my weight is the same but I think the biggest difference is that I can do most of the moves more easily I feel my arms is stronger not super strong but when I'm doing the workout I can last longer and my endurance is also so much better especially like the first days but then in the middle of the workout my body got like so pumped so I think there's like a little bit off in endurance but I can keep continue going and yeah we're done guys and we're gonna see the results okay, cool so take two kilograms cool Woo, thank you so much Lord I think yeah, I lost two kilograms so it was 59 and then 57 six, and then now it's 55 So I lost two kilograms each. Really amazing. Wow, I literally cannot believe this, guys. I'm gonna, I don't know. I don't wanna cry, <laughs> but I'm so happy, seriously. I was already preparing myself if my weight doesn't go off, like it's okay. But then, this is amazing. Yay, yay to more workouts. Okay guys, so that is all. Thank you so much for watching. I really don't know uh, in which situation you are right now. But if you are watching this video and looking for motivation 
to do your clothing workout or, or any other fitness challenge just do it i hope the tips work and i hope after you do the workout you can feel your body so much better so much stronger and you know what i cannot believe i did it maybe you were in a halfway of your workout and you don't believe you can finish this but believe it you can you can a lot of people have done this before and you can don't push yourself too much but just do it a little by little step by step and as Koei always said on like her you works out this. you can do this guys so thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed this video make sure you like subscribe comment and share it to your friends and don't forget to be great in your own way and I'll see you in the next one guys bye